Hello everyone. Welcome to VA Tech Talks. In this lecture, we are going to talk about how to create any point platform account. Okay? So in order to create an account, first we need to open any one of the browser. So in that browser, go to Google and type any point platform login. Okay? This is very first step. We need to do it. Okay. After entering any point platform login in login in your Google, okay, then you will get the page looks like this. Okay. You will get the page looks like this. Then click on very first link. Okay. Sign up any point platform. So here you can able to see there are two options. One is sign in and sign up. If you have username and password, we can directly sign in. So we are going to create an account. Okay. So for that, you need to click on sign up. Then we need to fill this form. Okay. It's like a registration form. Uh, full name. I'm going to keep it as VA Tech Talks. Okay. My email ID is VAT School 21 at the rate gmail.com. Okay. This is my official email ID. I'm going to provide here. So here you can provide your mobile number. So if you don't want to provide your original number, you can provide your dummy number also. That will also be fine. Then the company name, I'm going to keep it as Yonsoft. Okay. Next, the username and password is very important. In order to log in, this username and password is mandatory. So the username, I'm going to keep it as it is school underscore 04. Okay. This is my username. The password, I am going to create it as, see, you need to provide at least one number, one lower case, and it should be eight characters. Okay. So that's how you need to create. Test at the rate, one, two, three, four, something like this. Okay. If you provide that one, that will be fine. Okay. Let me... Keep it as my password. Okay. Then click on this. I am not a ro robot. Then click on this terms and conditions. And click on accept and create an account. So, okay. As soon as if you click on this, you will be able to, you will be able to see this web page okay you'll be able to see welcome page okay this is an welcome page for any point platform account so here you can see your organization name which you have given if you click on this uh, you can able to see your profile and sign out option if you don't want to be there in this space, you can click on this sign out. Okay. If you want to sign out or log out, you can click on this option. Then the, here we have many options. Like if you want to design any API, we can use design center and exchange any point studio. Okay. This is one more option. In order to download any point studio, just click on this link. Okay. So here, here, it will ask you for the few details. Here, you can click on any point studio and new. Select the version of latest. The operating system is Windows. You can provide your first name, last name, and your email ID. So the email ID is very important. The link will send to your email. Okay. Then you can download and you can use it. So that's how you can download. Okay, here, if you see any point platform, 
So these are the options that will be available. Anyway, these options we are going to talk about in going forward classes. Okay. Now I'm going to design one sample API. In order to design any sample APIs, click on this design center or else what you can do is, so here we have an options. There are three bars here. If you click this one, there is an option called design center. Okay. Okay, in order to create an API, click this create plus button. Click on this new API specification. Here you need to provide your API name. Okay. VA tech sample API. Okay. This is my API. It's loading now. So here you need to provide the version name. I'm going to keep it as version V1. So you can provide the description also. Okay, why we need to design this API and everything. Okay. Anyway, sample API, just I'll create. Okay. In order to create an API, we need resource path. Okay. First one is resource path. Okay. First one, I'll keep it as search okay or else what i will do i'll keep it as welcome colon okay and enter as soon as if you give an enter so the automatic i mean the suggestions the suggestions will come here the suggestions will come here automatically so here you need to select the which method you want to perform. I want to perform get method. So I'm not going to provide any input here, only response, okay? Then click on this responses. So the status code 200, click on this body. Click on this JSON, okay, which format the output should be application.json and example. In that example, I'm going to provide the results, okay? So, welcome to VA Tech Talks, okay? I'm going to keep it like, okay, welcome to VA Tech Talks. So, this is my API. So, if you see here, if you observe here, there is one endpoint, welcome. If you click on this get and if you click on this try it out, okay, then you'll be able to, you'll be able to see these results. Okay, now this is my API. Suppose I want to mock this API and I want to use this URL in outside of, outside of this any point platform. So there is an option mocking service configuration click on this mocking service configuration make it as public okay now you can copy this url just copy this url i'll go to i'll go to this browser itself okay just copy paste here so what is the resource path welcome right okay see you will be able to see the results okay if you want to test it via postman okay or thunder client so click here take this new request if it is a welcome page right okay simply i'll keep it as welcome let me copy paste that url So what is the resource path here? The resource path name we have to provide. Okay. Slash welcome. 
slash welcome okay so now we can able to see the results the status code is 200 okay the response is json format welcome to v8 tech talks that's how we can mock the api also okay that's it for this video thanks for watching this happy learning